Topping the news tonight, Prime Minister Kamala Prasad Basasa says the Point Fortin Highway is of great significance to the nation's economy as it will generate approximately 20 billion TD dollars within the energy industry in South Trinidad. Mrs. Prasad Basasa was speaking at the UNC's Monday Night Forum at Tool Citrus Hindu School in Pinao. Vanessa Haynes reports. Prime Minister Kamala Prasad Basasa made it clear that although she sympathizes with the stance of environmentalist Dr. Wayne Kublal Singh against the construction of the Point Fortin Highway, the initiative will continue. She addressed a contentious issue at last night's UNC Forum, where she stated that for the country's fiscal growth, the highway will produce long-term benefits. She said this included the modernization of the southwestern peninsula and investments from Mitsubishi and Petrotrin, in addition to a U.S. $3 billion investment. She highlighted that the Energy Ministry had recently completed a successful deep water bid round for the exploration of oil and gas. Last Thursday, Cabinet approved these which were won by BHP Billiton. Basad Basassin noted that the total investment associated with these successful bids is at least 580 million US dollars. BHP Billiton is an Australian company with revenues of US 72 billion dollars in 2012. It is one of the world's largest companies. They have been in Trinidad and Tobago for over 15 years. And with this, uh, these awards, they have now signaled renewed confidence in our country and its economy. The Prime Minister announced further that the Cabinet also agreed to the award of licenses to state-owned Petrotrin in respect of Trinmar and the North Marine acreages. As a result, she said there is expected to be heightened activity in Trinmar in 2013 and that activity will benefit the people of southwest Trinidad. Basad Basessa said that in 2013 to 2017, Petrotrin expects to spend $7 billion in the Trinmar and North Marine acreages. It will see the revitalization of crude oil production from Trinmar. This is a stated policy objective of my government. And so for you it will mean more jobs, more revenue and more development. She adds that more lucrative fruit for the South will include a $5.4 billion investment by Mitsubishi of Japan in partnership with Neelan Masi for the establishment of a methanol to petrochemicals project. At the peak of the construction of that plant, the Mitsubishi plant, it will create, directly create, 4,000 construction jobs right here in La Brea. And it will create, at the end of it, 265 permanent jobs. Passard Bassassin noted that in March this year, she announced the discovery of a Jubilee field, the largest by Petrotrin in more than a decade. She affirmed that Petrotrin has begun production from one of the wells in this field. She says the end result will bring more revenue for the country, while offering gainful employment to citizens, as many jobs will be created in the southwestern peninsula. Vanessa Haynes, C News.